Good morning, everyone. MSC Seashore, day two. We are currently um, pulling in MSC's private island, Ocean Key. I'm gonna head up and get some breakfast first, and then we're probably just gonna head out onto the island. Now today, I said it in yesterday's video, but unfortunately, they we are arriving later at Ocean Key, so they are not providing us food on the island. So stay tuned to see um, how that goes, if we survive with no food. But we are getting a cabana, so that should be exciting. So let's go. We just went to breakfast. We ate breakfast up in the buffet, out on the back deck. There were beautiful views of the ocean out there. But in update, we were not able to dock at Ocean Key, which is their private island this morning because of high winds. We're not able to dock to reach our private island, Ocean Key. We're not going, guys. So our captain, update. Captain. They are trying again in an hour or so. So we will see. I'm not too hopeful. Um, I don't know, because it's pretty windy out there. And I don't think much has changed. But we're going to see. So maybe we'll get out to the island. Maybe we won't. But if not, we are just going to enjoy a wonderful day here on the ship. But in the meantime, I think we're going to go to the pool or the hot tub or something. I don't know. It is kind of freezing outside. But we are going to try and enjoy the water because that is what I want to do today. It's a bit choppy today out there. Ooh. Yeah, that's why we're having issues docking. It is pretty choppy out there. The jury's still out if we're making it to the island. But they're trying. And the weather does seem like it's gotten better. So I don't want to get my hopes up. But. Either way, it feels good in the sun. If the wind stays away, it's a perfect pool day. So that's what we're doing for now. Okay, I think it's been a while since I've updated you guys. Um, I spent the entire morning and afternoon out by the pool. Even though it was freezing, I spent the entire morning and afternoon out by the pool. And then our captain finally got us docked at Ocean Key. We had some issues. He couldn't get in because of the waves and the wind. but third time trying to dock he finally got us in so i'm super thankful we get to spend at least a couple hours here at ocean key it is so cold here at ocean key it's probably 60 65 degrees so it's not like freezing but with the breeze it is freezing i did not dress appropriately but i mean the scenery come on you can't beat this but it is freezing so we ended up having a beautiful day here at Ocean Key. It's freezing. I did go swimming. It's like 60 degrees and breezy and I went swimming, but it was amazing. And we just watched the sunset, which was absolutely beautiful. Again, this is my favorite cruise on private island. I just love it here. I wish I could live here. Maybe I will. But, <laughs> but now we are headed back to the ship. We're probably going to get ready, see the show, go to dinner, all that fun stuff. So, yeah, see you on the ship. Well, we had a perfect day out at Ocean Key. Yes, I know that's another cruise line, but we still did have a perfect day at Ocean Key. Now we've come back to the ship, got ready, and now we're gonna head to the show tonight. I think it is um, a whole bunch of Broadway style hits. Um, so that should be exciting. We saw the show last night and the cast was super talented. So I'm sure tonight's show is going to be amazing. And then it's on to dinner. Tonight is Caribbean theme night, which is not my favorite menu. But um, it's fun. They do Caribbean theme menu and then they do a Caribbean party at night. So that's the night and we'll see where it takes us. So we just saw the show. Tonight's show was encore with all sorts of Broadway hits. It was really good. I thought the show itself was better last night, but again, the cast was still super um, talented. So, and now we are just um, hanging out until dinner, which I'm super excited about because I am hungry. So yeah, we'll see what's on the menu tonight. I honestly don't remember. So I am excited to find out. After dinner, we stumbled upon this game show in the lobby, which was really cool. They offered game shows in the lobby quite a few times during the cruise, which was fun. Then I grabbed an espresso martini, and then it was time for dinner. For dinner tonight, I had a Caesar salad as well as a French onion soup for my starter. The French onion soup was so good, probably one of my favorites. And then my main, I think I misread the menu because it was not what I was expecting. It was literally just spaghetti noodles with olive oil, but it was still decent. 
And for dessert, I got my favorite dessert of all time, key lime pie. So this is the Caribbean party. We got moved inside tonight because of the weather. But it's really popping. So we just got done with dinner. Dinner was actually pretty good tonight. Um, yeah, overall can't complain about dinner. Now we are on our way. The Caribbean party is happening over in the lobby. But um, we're skipping out on that and we're headed to the Love and Marriage Game Show, which is one of my favorite shows on a cruise ship. It's just so fun. If you haven't gone, make sure you go. And it's not on every MSC cruise, but um, this is actually the first time I've seen it on MSC. But I think this cruise director, the cruise directors do get to handpick some of the entertainment. And I do think this specific cruise director likes the show and wanted to include it. So I'm excited to see it on board MSC ships. Oh my god, we just got back from the Love and Marriage Game Show. That was probably the best Love and Marriage Game Show I have ever been to. Maybe ever, if not, definitely in a while. The cruise director, Indrigo, he was amazing. He was unhinged. He was so funny. The whole thing, the audience, everyone. It was just really good. And it was really long, which I like. It's not a bad thing that it was long. On Royal, I feel like they've been shortening it. They haven't been as edgy maybe so um i don't know it was really good probably the best love and marriage show i have ever been to and it was just so fun so i'm happy to see that on an msc ship because i don't think i've seen it on an msc ship maybe i have i don't know but it definitely wasn't on the last one i was on so i'm happy to see it here though but other than that that is a wrap on day two msc seashore we started the day off rough we didn't know if we were going to make it out to ocean key we did, thankfully, um, and yeah, it was a good day overall. Chilly, but it's always a great day at Ocean Key, and again, dinner was great, and the Love and Marriage Game Show was the perfect end to the night. So make sure um, you like this video, subscribe, do all the things, and I will see you tomorrow.